just popped the whole board. Okay, so Frankie found a drink called Deanna Troy's Chocolate Obsession. I typed it into Pinterest to see if I could find it, and instead it gives me ideas for you, starting with Star Trek Valentine's Day, Spock, Zachary Quinto, Star Trek Drinks, Funny Valentine's Poems, Leonard McCoy, Science Valentine's Puns, Valentine's Trivia, Thirsty Thursday Humor, Funny Valentine's Day Poems, and Valentine's Day Poems Romantic. For some reason, it thinks that it takes Deanna Troy's chocolate obsession and turns it into Valentine's Day. But yeah, let's uh, actually try the shot now, Frankie. Are you here? Did you yes. leave? Are you coming back? I uh, am. Yeah, I gotta use the chocolate yet. What? Wait, what? Insane trade for. I have no idea what he's saying. Yeah, I heard insane grade and whore. Insane. Rum, Sprite, and Tabasco. Rum, Sprite, and Tabasco. And blue Croco. And Blue Croco. Okay, I'm not huge on spicy things, but we'll try it. But it's only a little bit. I mean, I don't mind spicy, but it starts my Crohn's up really bad sometimes, so I don't do a lot of spicy. So we'll try it, if it's a tiny bit. Ooh, ooh, tookie tookie, bitches. <laughs> it's on my pot, it's the chair. The chair. <laughs> it is, listen. Oh, I can't do it, don't. No. There it goes. The leather in the chair. And I just hurt my nail. What's in this? Sprite, which you used to trail. Rum and, and what? Or is that all it is? Blue Caraco. You didn't leave much room for any Blue Caraco. I don't think you're supposed to use much. It said that. This is the last one I'm doing. Or I'm gonna have the worst hangover in the morning. There's a lot of mixed liquors. And you know what? With my medication, this is really not going to mix well. Oh, God. He's going to dump it. No! Ah! <laughs> so close! Please sip that off. I'm going to sip it off. <laughs> Shut up. Don't make me laugh. That's a weird taste. You left again. Frankie? Francis? I don't know. I shouldn't be doing as many shots. We did the Bazooka Joe one earlier too before all of the Star Trek ones, so this is going to be an interesting night slash morning, considering that I have to take my pills yet too for my back. Are you back? What is that? Tabasco. Oh, oh god, no. I forgot about the Tabasco part. Is that the mini bottles? Yeah. Ooh. I gotta open it up first. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Mini bottle. Yeah, these come in armories. Yeah, I got a sample thing at Walmart somewhere. Where's that at? Mm -hmm. I don't remember. They're cute. Won't taste cute in a moment. <laughs> no, probably not. <laughs> Does it make you want to watch Star Trek? Do you want to watch Star Trek Beyond? Since I just watched the 2009 and um, Into Darkness the other day because I couldn't sleep. And I have a weird habit of rewatching Star Trek movies. And sometimes the original series. Oh god, I can smell it from here. Yeah. Yeah. Boop. Say that again? One dash vitamin C. <laughs> What's that for? Klingon battle juice. Because <laughs> everybody keeps a dash of vitamin C laying around their house. <laughs> <laughs> 
I mean, I have some vitamin C pills upstairs when you do, like, crush it and put a dash in it. How does that work? I mean, that's how I would dig it. We could do Klingon Disruptor. We'll try this. Sure. We're gonna try to Klingon Disruptor, pretty strong. apparently. Of course, I'm already drunk. That's great. It's gray. Ew. You said gray. I said gray. I didn't say anything about gray, but if it is gray, ew. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you are the cap. It's the reason why everyone calls you cap. Because in the middle of uh, Age of Ultron, not even in the middle, it's like at the very beginning when he yells the language, both me and his cousin turn and look at him and we're like, mm-hmm, that's you. Because he yells at people for swearing all the time. I don't know what she's talking about. No, he's lying. She, yeah, she, she knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> she she's knows. drunk already. <laughs> Apparently, you turned into a she over the last couple of seconds. Yep. I might be feeling it. That's like my sixth shot. This is gonna be like. Is this the sixth? Let's see if it's six or seven, anyway. I don't mind gold soccer, but I um, was at my friend's graduation party one time, and he had gold soccer and apple pucker to make the what hot apple pie shots or something. And no, I know applesauce. Oh, that's what it was, applesauce. And I grabbed a bottle, thinking it was the wild, but the wild pucker. Yeah, the apple pucker, but. It was a gold slogger, and I chugged a whole mouthful of it, and he's yelling at me, he's like, SWALLOW IT! So, I haven't really drank it much since then. Oh, I seriously almost died proctologist instead of mixologist. Did you oh. need your chaser? Yes. <laughs> Shut up. Proctologist. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> How to make her lose her shit, <laughs> literally. Just is a doctor technically, so that would be a very incorrect and illogical statement. Illogical, illogical. What did I just say? I knew you meant. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. Let's go for the next one. What up with? You weren't even playing. <laughs> yeah, but I still put up with you. They know you're crazy. No. 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 He's touching me underneath the bar table. <laughs> Do not put that on. I'm putting that on. <laughs> See, now he's got my boobs behind the Enterprise. <laughs> he's going to dock the Enterprise. <laughs> now you have to explain it. <laughs> we were at Dragon Con back in 2016, and there was a girl that has a tramp stamp of the Enterprise with the NCC... Uh, 1701. Yeah, it's right there. I know. <laughs> and she has it on her back, right? So we just got done with the parade. We're part of the 405th Halo costuming group, and we're like in this big area of so it's Marriott, one of the hotels. And there's this girl with this giant transfer of, of the Enterprise. <laughs> and everyone's like, oh, I'm going to dock the Enterprise. So it just becomes this huge thing now that everyone's going to dock the Enterprise, right? So. <laughs> Somebody beat me up. <laughs> it's just this huge inside joke, pretty much, between a bunch of four or fifth members now that everyone's going to dock the Enterprise. <laughs> and, yeah, so here's the Enterprise. I don't know where I was going with this. <laughs> I sure hope she edits this out. And she will a, when she sobers up. Starfleet Academy. And I have, like, a bunch of pictures from Dragon Con of this year. Well, not this year, 2018, which was, like, last year, but this year. You know what I mean. And of us at Dragon Con in Starfleet uniforms. One more shot. Minus the fact that at Sci-Fi Valley Con last year in 2018. Did I say 2018 the first time? Or 2017? 2018. Oh, my God, Dragon babe, Con, just stop. 2018 <laughs> Sci-Fi, where... I had my Starfleet uniform on and my boots, right? 
going up the escalator carrying food so I can't pour down my damn skirt, which is like, clear up my ass. And there's like teenage boys behind me definitely like taking pictures and shit. And I'm like, these are so fucking illogical. Who illogical. makes these Star Wars fleet uniforms? Seriously. Why would any female wear this in actual line of duty? Because it would not make any sense. Nobody would wear them. No way. And and ranch. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, yes, Starfleet uniforms are illogical. <clears throat> he wants to do another one. I'm like, we have to be up early. Wait, what did you say about mine mailed? Well, mine mailed you. <laughs> You're doing it wrong. I know I'm doing it wrong. I'm not Vulcan. Oh my god, I'm a nerd that I know that you're doing it wrong. Do you want to do it? <laughs> No. I felt like just poke you with my fingernails. Oh god! My fingernails. It, it just like. This one calls for a cup, half a cup of sugar. Ew. Cisco's special version from Star Trek Online. Ew. But yeah, ew. Ground allspice, ground cinnamon. Seriously. Vulcan. Vulcan? Are you sure we should be doing another one? Vulcan Death Grip. We so, side note, when I was looking up. <laughs> Star Trek drinks, they found Romulan L Star Trek Oreo. So, would you guys eat it? Because he said he'd try it, and I just laughed because it's really weird. And if it was a real thing, I probably would actually try it because I'm weird too.